Gun violence and mass shootings seem to be in the news frequently. Gun violence is terrifying, and its effects can devastate individuals and communities. Although violence and shooting in schools are rare, unfortunately, they do happen. An obstacle in addressing gun violence is that violence is difficult to predict. While some factors, like a history of violence, can predict future violence, having a mental health diagnosis or displaying anger does not mean someone will act out violently. In fact, many people think about violence without ever acting on those thoughts. Thoughts of violence should be taken seriously. If you are having thoughts of violence or you know someone who is thinking about violence, you should tell someone. Telling someone could save your life and others' lives. Meet Cody. He's had destructive thoughts for a while. Cody's classmates would describe him as funny at times, but a little standoffish. They have seen his temper in class and are weirded out by his social media posts, which glorify and threaten violence. Everyone nervously laughs about how if someone were to shoot up the school, it would be Cody. When they're honest with themselves, they know this isn't a joke, and they are actually really afraid he might do something. Finally, a brave student brought up the social media posts and the uneasiness she felt about his posts to the school counselor. Cody's locker was searched, and a loaded handgun was found. As a result of the gun being found, proper action was taken to keep everyone safe and to get Cody help. While schools do their best to keep students safe, each student can play a big role in keeping yourself and others safe. If you hear about potential violence or see a social media post that is concerning to you, tell someone about it immediately. It could be the difference between a tragedy and saving lives. Lastly, if you are having thoughts of violence, take a step back and reach out to talk to someone. It could save yours and others' lives.